Yeah, what? If you don't have your tickets for Total Slaughter, you better go to Ticketmaster right now because July 12th is right around the corner. Platinum VIPs are sold out. The floor season gold VIPs are still available. If you want to watch it on pay-per-view, I suggest you go to TotalSlaughter.tv for more info on how you can watch the live TV broadcast. Previously on Road to Total Slaughter. Welcome to the House of Slaughter. You're putting eight battlers in a house together? Unbelievable. The four of us will be the judges for the tournament that's going to take place. He gets to pick one of you guys to battle right now. The loser is out of the tournament. Cortez. T-Rex makes people nervous. I mean, he's one of the best. Cortez, on the left. T-Rex on the right. This joint going to be one round, 90 seconds. Damn, I fucked that up all the way. I can't believe that shit. Check me, Cortez. Check me. So everybody know what they doing Fact. from game day. You see what I'm saying? We gonna show y'all niggas what it is so everybody can chill the fuck out. Fuck out of here. I got a battle Rex today. I'm, what the fuck? That's what we here for. Right. You're, you're a professional? Yeah. Hey, you see, this is what you signed mom. up for. Hey, watch your mouth when you talk to me. Watch your mouth when you talk to me. Watch your mouth when you talk to me. Your mouth, everybody want Jordan on their team. Watch your mouth when you talk to me, man. It would have been, <laughs> it would have been cool. Well, hey, Carl Malone, you gonna give me a good game? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Yo, this is what, this is what, it's, this is what we here for. My real career. I'm killer, ready man. now, man. Yeah, I got roughly eight and a half hours to get y'all shit together. This is some bullshit. So y'all gotta write got all that time. one minute and 30, and, and remember in about eight and a half. Let's get it done. Team Lux, Team Moot. At the end of the day, Arsenal still gonna walk out this house with more views and be in a household name more than everybody in here. Having to prepare around each other, it's like, you know, you gotta sneak off into a corner somewhere. And I think being in a house together, like, you know, it was kind of hard to find that privacy without your opponent you know, finding out what, what you got for them. I'm not as ready as these motherfuckers are, but I just have this little fire in me that's still there, so I'm just gonna do it all off the top. You're not a real battle rapper if you don't get the butterflies before you get on that stage. That's why I listen to Eminem's Lose Yourself before every battle. I always listen to it, just get me in my zone. Everything he said in that, it portrays a battle rapper's mentality on their way to do battle. It's slaughter time now, you know what I mean? It's so this is for the money. It's for the models, man. So we, so we got it. We gonna have to get it rocking. Welcome to round one of Road to Total Slaughter. K Slate, drama king of the building, my man Maul in the building, referee, and the winner of tonight will advance to the semifinals tomorrow night. How are we gonna do this? We're gonna flip a coin. Each rapper gets 90 seconds each per round, and the winners will be decided, of course, by our esteemed judges, Slaughterhouse. Artists will be judged on a 10-point system, and we'll be looking for two things, bars and delivery. In the event of a tie, we're going to take it to the contestants for the tiebreaker. So don't tie. Y'all been preparing all day for this? Let's get busy. Coming into this competition, I knew it was going to be an uphill battle. 
Last Summer Madness, I blew my cool and I punched Sirius Jones in the face in front of a huge crowd and I got banned from URL. When I was banned, it hurt me. I worked so hard that particular year and I kind of let my, my feelings get the best of me. But how you feeling these days, man? You know, last time I seen you, you were looking kind of angry. Yeah. Felt like the you devil. You about that shit, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, it, felt, it looked shit. like the devil ran through you for a second or something, man. It ain't really your character, man. You know what I'm saying? So K. Slate kind of pulls me to the side, and, you know, he hadn't seen me since uh, the Summer Madness 3 event. Apologize to that man, yo. I'm telling you heart to heart. Apologize to that man, yo. Sometimes you gotta grow up and take responsibility for your actions, and that's why I keep my hands to myself now. You know, he kind of gave me some advice. He tried to set me straight on the whole situation. I was disappointed in myself, but you're right. My last battle was against Pat Stay in Canada, and I lost. Who you battle? I battled Pat Stay for the title match. He sound good, yeah. I lost. Why? Because it's impossible to beat that dude in Canada, bro, with that many fans. People hated me, you know what I'm saying? And I went against the most loved dude in this country, and he's really good on top of that. And people can't beat him because he's just not beatable there. It's like battling the devil in hell and shit. I'm disaster, the dude that called all of Canada faggots. Oh, you yeah, have to you're understand. right, you're right, you're right. I'm the dude, they, they, they were not letting me take the chain. Like, you should have nah. that. But no, I knew I was going to lose, Luke. I wasn't tripping about that. I'm just mad at myself that I stumbled. My last battle made me want to walk away from battle rap for good. I battled back to back for the past like fucking like five or six years and it's just been too long, I'm burned out. This tournament has sparked a fire in me. This is why I'm still battling. It's just because of this. I'm giving this the last shot. Representing Brooklyn, New York. On my left, we got Mav Hoffa. And on my right, representing Los Angeles, California, we have none other than disaster. All right, gentlemen, y'all know how it goes. 90 seconds, the rules don't change. I'm gonna flip the coin, Math. I'm gonna let you call it. Tails. Math called Tails. Fuck the fucking coin. You go first since you're such a tough guy. <laughs> that's not how it works. I'm not sure that's how it goes, but I'm gonna look at the coin anyway. If you're not really causing people to flip out, then you're not doing enough. Disaster's trying to act tough. He clearly isn't prepared and he just wants me to go first so that he can rebuttal everything that I say. I'm not happy. I'm not prepared, but I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna beat him. See, we hey. gotta let the coin drop. No, I got you, dude. <laughs> Mav called Tails. It's Tails. You go first, Borat. <laughs> Disaster's on you. <laughs> Yo. Yo, your face is bushy like an Asian pussy. Why are you always giving me that mean face? You're a sweetheart. I'll probably make him run through Brooklyn and get me a protein shake the same way Puffy made Enes run and get him a cheesecake. Stop acting like you got gangster ass teammates. Your record is clean. You got a clean slate like the before and after picture in the average dinner on Big T's plate. Yeah. <laughs> you hold on. Yo, yo, you used to be massive. You was a beefcake, smoking crack, and you free base. I'll grab the back of your leg and leave it shattered in three places so you walk around with a fucking staff and a knee brace. I'll push your wig back further than the average smack battle release date. Yeah, these are deadly waters. It ain't a place for Matthew to feel safe. Come flapping like a seal. Get your hands and your feet. Ain't battling me is worse than swimming without a raft through a lake placid three lake. Yeah, doze me. I dare you to take a jab at me. You take a jab, then I'll duck it faster than you did the first time I asked you to come to Los Angeles and battle me. Yeah, yeah, he's small. I'm smaller, so naturally I have faster speedy. I wait for the attack, then I'll dance and weave and come back with a knuckle sandwich attached to a late transaction fee. He don't even have the brain capacity. He don't even have the brain capacity. I'll run up on his ass with a Sony blade fatality finish. Turn him into a straight bay valley, then take the little baby and mutilate his cavity quicker than Casey Anthony. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last night he was trying to be the king of spades at the table. You ain't no fucking king. You're like Freddie Mercury. You're a queen with AIDS. Yeah, he's all depressed because his little homie Cortez had to leave the stage, but look on the bright side. At least now we have a fucking Mexican cleaning maid. Yo, yo, you're 70. Yo, hold on, pause this shit, man. Fuck this. Hey, yo, you're 70% water and 30% lemonade, which makes sense. You put us on short time limits. You can't go unlimited. You can't concentrate. Your shit is minute made. Man. I didn't even get none of that shit out, man. Let me get that last bar out. Man, so you hold it down, y'all hold it down. Here we go, here we go. Let's get it. Yo, 
I can't ignore the sure fact before rap, you was bull rap. Before rap, I was out in the streets letting that four clap. Y'all know I got bars, but the jaw tap, we saw that. Knockouts. But look around, Diz, your comp is all black. So since you try to fit in with us, I give you more naps. Why you rap like Eminem on heroin? Cause when that shit settle in, you like, damn, he ain't said a thing. My talk show, I rock you for sport, like a letterman. I said, my talk show, I rock you for sport, like a letterman. You, fl you famous off the head, but a bitch like Evelyn. My Ocho full of cop killers, so it's irrelevant. If he invests, I still hang him up. Call that a Merrill Lynch. Okay. Now my man said, don't play. Hoffa, don't be nice. It's battle shit, straight disrespect. It's only right. You see, oh, fuck. It's battle shit, straight disrespect. It's only right. The second... Uh, this battle shit stay, straight disrespect is only right. The second the round's on me, my only vice is I get shady and drop niggas like OB Trice. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Diz, you creeping, you sleeping. My homies trife, they wake him up with the text like a nosy wife. You try to, you try to go against the grain. You try to go against the grain like you don't eat rice. They find your body sideways like an emoji, tight. I catch this, I catch this air you have on the road, I pull him out the jag, chop his calf with a machete till it drop in half, flip him over like, is you ready? Then I pop the mag, the things a black man gotta do just to stop a cat. <laughs> Why right, now we gotta we gotta get we gotta get it to the judges, y'all. We gotta get it to the judges. That's gonna be kinda tough. Math bounce back. I'm gonna give you a nine, disaster. And I'm gonna give you a nine, math. Because both of y'all slipped up, but you came back so hard, my brother. I gotta, I gotta, I'm calling it even. I'm calling it nine nine. Not ten ten. Nine nine. Nine nine. Joel. Great, great uh bounce back by Math. I mean Great bounce back by math, but just, just not enough for me to give it to you. Uh, disaster is hilarious. <laughs> He's funny. He was he was on top of his game, and um, I got I say he edged him, so I say ten nine. Joe, I heard half of that verse before from Disaster. I feel like what? <laughs> I did, and if I had a computer in front of me, I swear I could find it. I definitely never spit that shit before. Nice bounce back from math. We can go to Crook, because cause I do want to check something, but I'm almost certain that I heard quite a few I of those put money bars. on it right now. 100 bucks. And, and, and in the event that I'm incorrect, then I'll come back. But I'll, I'll, let, I'll let Crook do that, do that first. 10-9 Diz. Only, only, only because of the stumble, you know what I mean? Because he came back with a vengeance. So I don't, like if he did, if he went straight through, yo, math, if you went straight through, then I would, I would be, you know what I'm saying, at odds with. Oh, so my vote is I'm gonna right. say 10-9, no dis though. So my vote is irrelevant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so now that the judges have decided the winner of this battle, Los Angeles, California, disaster. Jesus Christ. <laughs> If I ever face off with disaster again, he's dead. Slaughterhouse being the judges, you know what I'm saying, it's a gift and a curse for me. Me and Joe got into it on Twitter. I think it was the summer of 2012, maybe. Joe put out a record called uh, Spring Training, and my Twitter went crazy. I clicked the link, I hear the song. He mentioned my name a few times. He said some quotes about me and just, and I'm like, wow, like, it's, it's like this. Like, you know what I mean? I took advantage of it because it's Joe Buttons, first of all, you know what I'm saying? And that, you know, it gave me some light. In 24 hours, I was in my studio and I did a response track called Spring Cleaning, where I went about, uh, I say about 100 bars of just torture and tormenting and just antagonizing and hurting that man's feelings. 
On my left, we have representing Newark, New Jersey, Arsenal the Rebel. Yeah. And on my right, representing Watts, California, Daylight. Yeah. Now, as, as Case Slate told y'all earlier, it's 90 seconds around. We're looking for bars and performance. So I'm gonna call, who gonna call it? Tails heads? Not sales, but. Tails? Right. They like called Tails? Uh -huh. It's heads. Let's go. Arsenal's been talking a big game all week about how many views he got. This shit is based off bars and delivery. YouTube views is not gonna save you. That's why I'm gonna win. I said, 50K. That's officially my price now, yeah. For those who know me, check my pass roll. You'll see that I'm the shit asshole. It's an afro. Nigga, I'm nice around here. <laughs> <laughs> or I can just put the fist to the side of his head. Black power. Or I can give him Mel K's headshot sleep. I see you got the better dream. Check my pass roll. You'll see that I'm so warm. It's Mr. Hanky in the snowstorm. This is gonna be the coldest shit you ever seen. Mm. I mean, remember when I was to the side? Debo, he know my energy sub-zero. And that's why I'm cold-hearted. They got me here for one reason, to kill all these white niggas. Look at all these Jack Thrillers. It was over for them before the show started. <laughs> But this is when I make you look like the feather. Wait, 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 wait. That's called quail, nigga. When I go rage, niggas cry on stage. That's cause I'm ill, nigga. I had schools loose since I was a baby. These kids better know the drill, nigga. You seem frightened, like Teen Titan. I've been robbing since a little, nigga. That's real, nigga. You better have them pockets assured, or I get to score. Candy bars you can't cop at the store. I'm cocking the four. If he fuck with me, it's three's company. I'll have two bitches come and knock at your door. <laughs> Your bitch love me. She been reaching out, trying to let my dick drill her. Her weave ratchet, but her bun be on point. That bitch triller. Pistol on a Kardashian, I let Kim kill her. Why this gay lord watching me fuck her? You been stiller. You try to win this battle with intellect? What about those who don't catch it? They can't intercept. I become the bigger threat. In these streets, I'm linked like the Cuban around Jigger Neck. I always got some iron in my jeans. I keep my denims pressed. Keep plenty heat. Stick a knife through any beef before my dinner bless. I Swiss beats. Did a bid for some dope. Floating up Shit's Creek. But I'm home now. No longer in my state property. Chris Neef. First nigga think shit sweet before that shit stink. Three niggas stomping with both shoes. Alive, we bury day six feet. How you real? Why, cause a face tat got a new deal? Hollow get lux, I get stuck with the weirdo nigga from Drew Hill? You ain't get arse cause you nice? You ain't get arse cause you nice and got mook skill? You got arse cause you lowered your price, nigga how the truth feel? We both lokin', blue steel, get his big body a coupe feel. Chop this nigga down a size, he get his roof pill. I keep live bands, give you that roots feel. Just like being on death row with no limits. He done signed one of Snoop deals. My bar's crazy, I don't need sign language to let my hands speak. I throw wild punches in a circular motion like I was Zangief. You rap on instrumentals, I surround beats. Whatever they want, I got it. If I don't got it, I'm gonna get it. I'm hustle, man, chief. <laughs> Next is death or the same vehicle as Professor X. Have my young niggas drawing you. Call that an extra sketch. Heavens, how high? Ass red and meth. You a gigantic asshole, nigga. A rectum stretched. <laughs> confident at this moment. My performance was phenomenal, through the roof. Maybe one of the best that I've ever done. So I'm gonna throw it over to Slaughterhouse Royce. It's on you. Both rounds were amazing. I scored a 10-10. 10-10. Mm. Um, yeah, it was pretty down the middle, man. I'm gonna have to agree with, uh, with Royce. I can't, I can't pick a, a loser. So forget a winner, I can't pick a loser. So 10-10. Mm. And I don't want to pick a loser. I, I, I don't. 
they, as far as lyrics went, both top notch. As far as performance went, both top notch. I scored it 10-9, daylight, solely because of the Afro line. And that literally was the deciding factor for me. The one line. I, I'm gonna I'm just say 10-10, man. That's where I'm at with it. I'm at 10-10. This battle was extremely close, but R slipped two times, and those two slips were milliseconds. Those are points to death. That is the only reason why I say I won the battle. The judges have decided narrow. It's a very narrow decision, but the decision goes to daylight. Make some noise. Everybody already know, me and Joey went through our, you know, our problems. And out of Slaughterhouse, the one person that I ever had a problem with is the reason I lost the battle. This is for my get fly. Riders like them chicks by your side when you got caught. They with the chick you had your kid by. Coward niggas switch sides. Most of this world's a big lie. So the model that I live by is fuck them till my dick die. Hot for babies, kind of crazy boy. I let that clip fly. Drama lately constipates me. I ain't letting shit slide. BK will be sell drugs. RIP to my dead thugs. YB, my nigga black. True blue to that red blood. If niggas wanted you dead, cuz who the fuck really gonna Shed blood.